everybody, so we're back here. Got a guest out on the range today, Mr. Christian Grass. Man, hey, welcome to the range, brother. Yeah, it's glad good to be to here. Have you here, man. Uh, how was the trip? That was good. Right on. A little, little bit out in the country. What do you think? Yeah, oh, it's awesome. <laughs> Living the life. <laughs> All right, well, he brought some fun toys, so we're just going to have a little day of some fun shooting and just chill out and relax, and I'll show some video of the shooting. It ain't going to be nothing more than that, just a fun day of shooting. All right, well, let's uh, get loaded up and we'll get at it. What do you say? All right, yeah. Right Thanks for having me. <laughs> All right, Christian brought a CZ Scorpion. First time ever getting to shoot one of these. I always wanted to buy one, just haven't had the funds for one yet, so we're going to give it a shot. See how we do. Feels good being lefty on this thing, too. Empty. So. I like it. I like it. What's the mag release? Is that what that is? Oh, it's a paddle. Yeah, it's in front oh, of the trigger okay. guard. Pretty neat. Pretty dang neat. I like it a lot. <laughs> now I'm going to have to buy one. My <laughs> wife's not going to be too happy about that, but oh well. That's nice. It's accurate as all get out too. <laughs> yeah, I bet, right? So uh, this is a AR-22, right? You call it, I guess? Yeah. Uh, with a suppressor. So it's going to be real quiet. Uh, something that Christian, you built this whole thing from yep. scratch, right? The arrow precision. This looks like uh, well, everything's arrow on Yeah, the receiver set, the handguard arrow precision. Uh, the parts kit, I think, was Bravo Company. And then the yep. uh, barrel is a CMMG 4.5 inch with a... Uh, their uh, special 22 bolt carrier, yep. and then the suppressor is Tactical Solutions. Yep, and then these are the MBUS sites, right? Yep. Right on, all right, so let's go ahead and... Got one in there. This thing's so close. Where's the sound? <laughs> <laughs> There's no sound. This is awesome. Thing on the target. <laughs> that is sweet. Oh, empty. <laughs> that is amazing. I really like that. <laughs> I never thought suppressed shooting could be so fun, but oh man, it's like add tens, adds 10 times more fun to it just because you're not sure if you're actually shooting the gun or not. <laughs> it's great for pest control too so yeah right on yeah this is a cool little gun man i like this yeah check it out oh. the 357 magnum now that's a Taurus, so be careful <laughs> <laughs> holy hell I can't believe I'm not hitting the dang target. Yeah, with the uh, double action, it's really, really tight. So, all right. There you go. I was aiming too high. I see exactly what I did. Oh, was it going through the hood? Yeah. Yeah. Enough of that. I'm all single action only. <laughs> I think that's it. Yeah, that might be. Yeah. Do one more shot. Yeah, there it is. Empty. <laughs> Man, that double action was getting me. It's been a while since I shot a revolver, apparently. Yeah. <laughs> This is so such a low profile.
<laughs> yeah, it's just so low, you know, it's so tiny of a sight. It's hard to really look through it. So what do yeah. you think? I'd probably have to put a riser on that myself. Yeah, I'm thinking about it because it's kind of uncomfortable to shoot with that low profile sight on there. It's a nice sight. It looks good. Yeah, no, the, the red dot's awesome. Yeah, I'd have to throw a red, I'd have to throw a little bit of a riser on there, but man, that thing shoots smooth though. Yeah, yeah, not bad. All right, so this is another. You built this one too, right? I did. <laughs> All Aero 300 Blackout suppressed what's the suppressor on here it's a rugged uh their razor 7.62 okay we will pull the sba3 brace so we're gonna give it a shot and see how it works never shot 300 blackout so this will be interesting all right there it is Ooh, that's a nice crisp scope I wanted to knock that one out of the thing. Oh, out of bullets. Whew. Man, that's nice. Like, not it, much sound. It doesn't recall. No, it doesn't make a lot of sound. Little. Nope, nope. Yeah, it doesn't make a lot of sound. Put that suppressor on there. I tell you what, man, I need to get some more stuff like this. <laughs> I especially like how it says no pew pew and pew pew pew. Love it. <laughs> it's nice. Not heavy at all or anything either. Yeah, I've had that one quite a quite a few. Uh, that's much easier to see now that I got my hat backwards and I'm <laughs> not worrying about the brim. Uh oh, what I do? Oh, misfed. See, the magnet inserted all the way up, maybe? Uh, it was in there, just uh. Here, hold that mag real quick. Yeah. Alright, let's try it again. This is a it's mag pull. Yeah, it looks like an M. Is it, it's an M2. I've shot. Some three, sometimes 300 blackouts, the subs are hang up a little bit on the mags, depending on which ones they are. Okay. Yep, did it again. Uh. Yeah, that's exactly what's happened. It's hanging up, going yeah. off the mag. Alright, well, we won't use that mag then, because that's all I got is those. No, that's alright. <laughs> Try her again. Yep, yep. <laughs> oh, the camera's still going. Alright, let's see what we can get now. Let's see if the hex mag works any better. And that brace is really nice too. Yeah. It's soft, it doesn't like dig into you or anything. So that is excellent. Yeah, yeah. that's the only brace I got like that. I, I'd like to get a couple the more. The magazine smoking. <laughs> yeah, the hex mag way better than a M2 mag pull mag for sure. Yeah, it actually worked, and it uh, I was able to do a mag dump, and it was okay. <laughs> no jams on that one. Right on. This thing is great. So this is a Grey Ghost Precision Slide. This is a Palmer 80 build that you did? Yeah. Okay, nine millimeter, obviously, yep, yep. All right. So it's a Glock. <laughs> <laughs> but it's not a Glock. All at the same time. So let's give it a shot, see what we get. how the uh, mag release sits out and that trigger is oh my god yeah the trigger is a overwatch precision trigger yeah. so it's it's a pretty nice trigger as far as lock triggers go it's 
loud too. It's a lot louder than a normal nine, I think. But it's it's a lot more comfortable because the swoop here I can actually fit. Yeah, my it's big, undercut the trigger yeah, guard. Undercut. So. Yeah, I can fit my big fat finger in there a little bit better. <laughs> I can't shoot the the stock block frames. Yeah. Uh, very good, especially if they got those dang finger finger grooves on there. Let's try it again. Yeah, I can't either because it digs in. It like tears up my middle yep. finger. Yeah, that red dot uh, red dot dances if you're not careful. Gotta figure out how to get it back on point quick. Yeah. With the red dot. Let's try the other one. Uh, let's see. That's the other Palmer 80 build right there. Oh wait, we got oh we got one more magazine. Yeah. So what's different about this one? Uh, that so one? that one is actually a frame that came already 100%. It's serialized from the factory, and oh, okay. it's a uh, Brownells exclusive uh, texturing on the grip. And that one I built kind of to maybe carry. I didn't want to do a homemade one for carry, so I wanted right. something serialized. And then uh, it's kind of a plain Jane, uh, other than it's got you know Brownell slide, Grey Ghost Precision Barrel, and yep. it's got Night Vision uh, night sights on there. So I kind of I kind of like the big front sight and the subdued yeah. rear. Um, that kind of works better for my eyes. Yeah, I like so. the way it looks too. That sight looks pretty good. Let's see what we get when we shoot it. The trigger on that one's an Apex uh, action enhancement kit, much like I did with the uh, my wife's Glock 19. Right, that's nice too. I like this one too. That sight's real easy to put right back on yep. target. And that's why I like so. it. Yeah, the lower bore access too helps a little bit. But yeah, I like how it goes right back on target real easy and it's big enough that it stands out and you can really see it. I got bad vision too, so that, that helps a lot. Yeah. yeah my All right. Yeah, I didn't load it. <laughs> now you tell me. <laughs> well, I just figured, you know, being safe and all. Yeah. I'm I'm shooting at the biggest target too. Yeah. <laughs> it's it, the sights are a little funky to get used to. Yeah. <laughs> Table full of guns. That's just another little day here at the range. <laughs> All right, everybody. Thanks to my special guest. We had a great day today. Uh, Christian Grassman, thanks for coming out, man. Yeah, thanks to, for having me. Good to meet you in person finally. We've been talking for a while, and it's great to get you out here. Uh, maybe next time we can shoot down your way. Sometimes. Yeah, yeah. Right on. So, uh, it up. All right, everybody. Thanks for watching. Have fun.